Okay, so we're here on a power vent. It see the power vent there. Water heater. See the water heater. Service call. Previous technician was here. Um, I came, and um, they have this error code on here, which is vacation light here and C. So when I look on the left of the water heater here, here is the actual uh, legend. So if I look on the bottom of the legend, you see it right here. There's the error code right there. You go to the right, flammable vapors near water heater, control and lockout. Here's the flammable vapor sensor. So usually that goes off that there's any type of flammable material around, paint, uh, household cleaner, anything like that, it'll shut off the water heater. But when upon further inspection, do you see all of this? See all that rust and water residue? So another technician came here, replaced this, which is the actual relief valve. Uh, the older one was here. This is the one that it came with. So if you have a water heater from like 2007, 2008, 2009, 2010, they actually use this plastic relief valve. What ends up happening is it expands and contracts, expands and contracts because of heat, cracks, and then you have water. So they replaced it with this brass fitting, but this isn't even the problem. The problem is this is actually saying that it's not working or something is wrong based on this error code, right? But when I put my hand inside here, it's full of water. This whole thing is just full of water. So the tank rusted out from the inside, it's leaking, hit this, shut this off, which shut this off. So the actual solution for this being that the tank is from 2008, October 20th, and now it's July, 2024, it's 14 years old, is to replace this water heater. And to replace it, they just remove the gas here, remove the actual power vent from the two inch 636 venting here, cut the plumbing there and there, drain this into the drain over there, install the new one, connect the gas, connect the plumbing over here and push this back in here, turn it on and in 45 minutes they have hot water. So once again, for all my technicians, make sure you do proper diagnostic don't just rush in, rush out. Don't be a parts changer. And even just looking at the condition of this tank, look at that. You can tell. You see it's charred over here because the TMP is just so damn hot. The customer had to turn the heat up, obviously, because it wasn't working. And the relief valve, if you looked even further, if, instead of changing the relief valve, if you looked at in here, he would know, say, that you have to replace the water heater just because it's just burnt and rustic and crustic inside. So replacement is going to happen see you on the next video like and subscribe and don't forget handle your service calls with proper care have proper technicians come and do a proper job peace and love happy hvacking